there. It's me, Anne, here from Anne Makes on YouTube and also annemakes.blogspot.com, the blog where I share lots of DIYs, how-tos, and all sorts of projects, and lots of instructions on uh, uh, crafty things and such. So I just came back from Dollar Tree. Well, no, not true. I did stop at A&W and picked up some lunch. So now <laughs> I'm officially back from uh, the Dollar Tree, followed by NW. So uh, the first item I want to show you from my trip to Dollarama today is this mug, which I think is really cool. I love it. It's got all these Canadian icons on it. Um, I guess it's part of the new uh, Canadian collection, you know, getting, there was lots of stuff for uh, Canada Day in the store, and um, I so appreciate that Dollar Tree, although you are a U.S.-based company, that you, you bring out stuff for us Canadians, and this is, this is really fun, this is a really fun mug. And in Canada, by the way, for uh, those of you who may be new to my channel, uh, in Canada, our Dollar Trees are a dollar twenty-five Canadian for each item. I got this bottle of mustard. Uh, just looked like a good mustard to try, and my sons love to make sandwiches even more so since the nice weather is here, and so I got that for them. Followed by this big, awesome floor cleaner. Well, that's what it says. It's awesome. <laughs> uh, lavender scent. I use this in uh, my bathrooms. I, I pour this into the uh, toilet brush holder thingy. So there's always some liquid cleaner there in each, in each of our bathrooms. And it, it kind of smells nice in the bathroom, too. So, And yes, I use it to clean the floor, too really inexpensive. It's $1.25 for all that. I just picked up a six pack of the Nestle Pure Life uh, water bottles. We are just completely out of bottled water. We do have refillable cups and stuff, uh, but sometimes uh, we, we need to have something like this that is more disposable just for convenience sake because of where we're going and such um, and uh, we usually buy the big case at Costco but we just totally ran out and we aren't doing a Costco run for a few more days so I just bought that to tie us over until then I picked up this bag of go-to snacks for my guys sour cream and onion rings I can't eat this stuff so it's not for me. I did get something for me besides my my really cute mug here. Uh, I got these scarves. I just think they're so fun. They had just put them out at my store, or I hadn't been there in oh over like two weeks, so I've been a while. And I just got there were so many, and I didn't I didn't even buy one of each, but I did buy many. So these are the ones I bought and I'm just thinking oh these are great to wear with you know a t-shirt and a pair of jeans to kind of you know stay casual but look a little you know dressy and pretty and this one because it's red and white <laughs> I'm I think I'll bring this one on my business trip next week because I'm going to the U.S. and there's not going to be many Canadians at this conference. I know that. So maybe I'll stand down a little bit <laughs> with my, my Canadian scarf around my neck. Um, picked up a bag of the Toad Alley Choczels. I have not had any of these in about three weeks, so I am due. Oh, do my Dollar Tree got these stamp, uh, ready, set, stamp little kits that I've seen so many other people haul. Uh, so this is what my Dollar Tree had, and so this is what I bought. The uh, set of stamps, which one is it that I have here? This set of stamps says remember, and it's like little 
lines for notes and like a little flag here. And this set of stamps is wishing you uh, a very happy birthday. Can you see that? Wow, it's, it's really hard to show. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the uh, stamping acrylic block. The other thing that was available at my store were the small ink pads. There were two little ink blocks in a package, but I have a lot of ink, so I did not get that. I got this roll of washi. I thought it was kind of cute. And I think that's it for you. Oh, I just picked up a package of these uh, double-sided highlighter pens. <clears throat> <clears throat> I will be bringing these on the airplane with me uh, next week. I I try I, I, every trip I take I try to pack lighter and lighter <laughs> and I just need to have pens with me and stuff because I have like six to eight hours to kill between airports and, and flights and stuff so I will probably be doing a lot of um, work in my uh, my planners and and just doing like lots of boring work that needs to get done so I might as well do it when I have all this time to kill and I uh, and this is like two in one so it takes even less room in my my carry-on I got some more of these delicious by the way watermelon uh, salt water taffy uh -huh, they're so good and I saw that they had cotton candy flavored one so I got some of that too I got these sticky notes. They're new to me at my Dollar Tree. This one says, make great today. They're nice thick pads. There's a hundred sheets in each of them. This one is stop wishing, start doing. Uh, this one is stay kind and be honest. Now that, that's something I believe in. That's really me. And it's pink and it's got roses. And I'm always all about being kind and being honest. So, yeah. This is my favorite one. And this says, oh, say yes to adventure. They're really pretty sticky notes. I got this little pencil case that has an elastic. And I will be putting my uh, double-sided pens highlighters in there, and I will be putting, strapping this over my Happy Planner, which will be with me when I travel, because as I said, I'm tr I try to travel really, really light and bring the least amount of stuff with me possible, but I do have some work to do, so I will have the essential pens I need in here with my planner and I have I have inserted notebooks in in my happy planner so I will have everything compact with me uh, hopefully this will work got this uh, set of travel jars I know they say travel jars I do find them a little bit big for uh, <laughs> A trip like I'm taking but uh, the these could have multiple uses they could be used for all sorts of things when you travel but they can also be used in, in the craft room as well or to uh, take large uh, like glues and Mod Podge or whatever from a really big container make small containers so either beauty supplies health products or even art supplies uh, can be put in these under the, the screw-on lids, so that's good. Oh, like I said, there was a lot of stuff for Canada Day, and they had these cute little LED lights. Uh, there's 10 on a string here, and of course, they're little red maple leaves. I thought this will be really cute, so maybe I 
can use these when we celebrate Canada Day or just because I want to show off that I am a proud Canadian. I can't, I'm kidding, I won't do that. Oh, here's, here's the other stamp set that my Dollar Tree has right now. And I got that one with the flowers and hello. Yeah. Oh, I want to show you, there were a lot of these new baskets. Uh, the size, it looks like it's letter size. I just bought one. I'm going to see how it fits on a shelf in my office. And if it fits really well, I'll go back and get more. They had them in this uh, bright kind of pink color. They also had them in a type of teal, like the, the, the bag here, this kind of teal, uh, and a turquoise. And I think there was another color. I can't remember. I saw some red, too. So... I got that, and in, in here I, right now is all the, the makeup stuff I bought at uh, Dollar Tree. Uh, travel size antiperspirant. A, uh, this, is a, this is a travel size, apparently, tube of uh, skin cream, uh, but it's going to be traveling in my car. I just thought sometimes I, my hands are very dry and I just want to leave this in my car. And I uh, was happy to see some new beauty products. Uh, I keep saying I don't wear much makeup, but I seem to buy it all the time at Dollar Tree when I see it. Maybe I'll start wearing it. Uh, there's, they have these tubes of primer, and I just got two because I thought they were small. And it's primer, uh, like for under your makeup, I have no idea how how well this works. Uh, I am not. I am really not a makeup expert, and it says that this is the clear shimmer. I do not know what that means, but I will try this as a base under my makeup. And I next week I will be wearing makeup because I will be with the public and yeah I have to look presentable I got three of the NYC lipsticks and these are the colors they just have numbers on them so they look they look nice they look like colors I might wear and since I buy like a lipstick will last me for years because I don't wear it very much I thought I'd indulge myself with three this time, so I'd have three colors to choose from. Oh, I love finding the little mascara at Dollar Tree because I only buy these when I travel because they're small and I love the size and they're just perfect for my trips and they, they just don't take much room in my bag. Got that. Lip balm. Uh, one of the guys in my family was in need of a lip balm, so I got him that. This is new to me also. It's also by Mariposa. Uh, the primer, sorry, I didn't tell you that, is uh, Mariposa. And this is Eyebrow Sculpting Kit. I don't know if anybody knows what that is, really. Eyebrow, sculpt eyebrow sculpting kit. This is to help redesign your eyebrows. I don't know if I have eyebrows. I don't know if I want to add anything to them. And they had they had blacks and they had browns. So I figured I better go for browns because well I'm I have brown hair. So that and they had several bronzers and I don't know a lot about bronzers so I took the lightest color that they had. This one, and so yeah, uh, my Dollar Tree just had this. There were there was a lot, a lot of the NYC, a lot of the bronzers, uh, the Mariposa products, all these new products. I'm showing you was brand new. They had just put them out, 
There was a lot, and I thought, wow, um, $1.25 for lipstick? Uh, even if I only use it a few times, I'm glad I only paid $1.25. So, that's good for me. And... My Dollar Tree didn't have any of the little mini planner clear page protectors or anything or the dividers or anything. And I'm a little upset because when they did get them, I thought I would be really nice and not just buy out what was in the store because I wanted to leave some for other people. And I just bought a few. But now that I go back, every time I go back, there's nothing left. So... <laughs> Looks like other people bought out the rest. So, learned my lesson. Next time I see something I want to stock up on, I, I think I'll just stock, stock up on it and not worry about other people. Sounds me, but yeah. Uh, they have these new corrugated file holders, and I had just bought a whole whack of them from IKEA. The white ones, so uh, because I couldn't find these anymore at Dollar Tree, and now Dollar Tree has <laughs> these cute, colorful ones. So I will be like incorporating these with the the white ones from IKEA. So I got some like this, and a blue one because I wanted another one that matches some other blue ones I have. The cute designs. I got this barbecue cover. It's green and I'm, I would have preferred a different color, uh, but I'll try it out. It's just, it would be nice to keep the barbecue clean because I know that with spring we always give the barbecue a good cleaning and then we get all this yellow sticky pollen and then the barbecue's not clean anymore. So hopefully we could just keep the barbecue cleaner a little bit longer. I got a couple of these uh, poly envelopes, the kind that have this strip that lets you pull it out to put, push in and out of a binder. And they have a button snap closure. Got some more heavy duty large trash bags, uh, eight of them. We are doing spring cleaning every weekend, so. We need bags, kitchen garbage bags, as well, we have garbage every day in the kitchen. Go figure. Oh, and here I got this decoration for Canada Day. They had some really pretty ones, and they even had some for Canada's 150th this year. And I almost got that one too, but I just got this one finally. It says Canada on six. Maple leaves and it's sparkly, shiny. Yay! Yay! Go Canada! Oh, I got another scarf. This one is for Canada, and it is one of those uh, scarves that is um, a scrunchy, a hoodie, little cap, wristlet thingy, and it's pretty. It's black with white, and it's very stretchy. But look, it has maple leaves. Can red maple leaves. Ta da! Uh, a repurchase. If you watch my videos, you know this is uh, one of our favorite soaps, hand soaps to put in the boys' bathroom. So I've got another one of those. And of course, napkins. This is what we. This is where we get our everyday napkins. They're just so inexpensive and yeah, I save on laundry. <laughs> okay, so that is that for my Dollar Tree haul. It is smaller than some other hauls I've done, but I really, I there wasn't anything else that I needed to get. And I didn't see anything else that caught my eye. There's a lot of things that I would have liked to have seen that I've seen other uh, 
Canadian uh, YouTubers for do uh, with Dollar Tree hauls show, but my store didn't have those. So this is what my store had and that I wanted and needed. So that's what I got. So I'm hoping to get this video edited and up uh, sooner than most videos. I'm sorry, it takes me a really long time to get videos out to you guys because I edit them a lot and it's not the only thing I have to do. I have a lot of other things to do. I do a lot of social media work for companies and uh, so the, the, the dollar store haul videos are kind of, you know, they're just because I think it's fun to do them but they don't take the priority that I would I would like to give them uh, just uh, because you guys you know are so so nice to uh, have subscribed and to keep watching my videos so thanks so much for supporting me uh, thank you so much for watching this video and uh, please leave your comments I you know I love them I read them all and I will uh, take care of yourself because I will catch you up to the next haul bye